Beyond, welcome back. The fifth installment of Two Off the First. I am Matthew Brown. Besides me, as always, my very good friend, Quinn Roddy. How are you doing today, Quinn? I'm doing great. What an exciting weekend. Uh, I can't believe this is our fifth show. Fifth Look show. at us. We're just cranking them out. Um, Thank you for all yeah. the support. Yeah, I appreciate you guys. But really, really exciting weekend. Uh, the players did not disappoint. Uh, once again, I mean, it's, it's the fifth major for a reason. These guys were just striping it around. Uh, we saw a friend of the program, our buddy Justin Thomas, yes. pull it out. Yeah, he was unbelievable. I mean, like they said on the telecast, that course is a ball striking course at TPC Sawgrass, and that's exactly what he did. Square on the club face, never a doubt, every time. Yeah, he had every shot in the bag. Shot a 64 on Saturday, uh, which was, I think, the best score yeah. all weekend. Okay. So he absolutely deserved to win it. Got a little bit emotional talking about Tiger, talking about his grandpa who passed away. So, so yeah. happy for him, yeah. JT. Hell of a weekend. Yeah, good for you, JT. Uh, we're cheering for you. Come come on. Come on the next episode. Yeah. We'll talk about it. You know it. you want it. Yeah, come on. But uh, anyway, another cool fact was through the first 33 holes, JT shot even. Mm -hmm. His last 33 holes, minus 14. Yeah, that's just straight up impressive. Incredible. I'm not sure how that math works out, but we'll that, figure it out. That's, I mean, oh, I, and the I read it on couple Twitter. Turns. Yeah, yeah, I read Twitter it on Twitter. a lot. No. But yeah, it's uh, he was just incredible. Shot 14 under, and then... Uh, second weekend in a row, we had Bryson and Lee Westwood battling it out. Yep, yep. and this time, Lee got him on the 18th hole. Got for him second train that place. birdie. That's a big $500,000 Yeah, Cha-ching, cash guy. One putt. Wow. One putt. Yeah, that was, uh, that was nice to see. Um, you know, we saw Bryson win last weekend, and I was shocked that Westwood was there again. He's yeah. really playing well for such a 46-year-old. Yeah. Um, he's probably just getting a nice little back yeah. massage today, stretch out the muscles because... He was hurt for sure, oh, battling, yeah. but 13 under is a hell of a score. Did you hear his drama? No. Fiance out on the back. Whoa. His fiance has been caddying for him the last few times. They said Lee Westwood and his son played a practice round at Augusta the other day. Wow. Fiance's out, son is in. Talk about in the doghouse. Yeah. Holy moly. He's going to be sleeping on the couch for the next week. But I mean, hey, if it works, it works. I think it's just we'll business. See. I don't we'll think it's see. personal. I hope not, because she cannot be happy. Yes. Uh, but anyway, we saw some Great. hilarious moments. Uh, is that 17th hole just never yeah. disappoints. Uh, our buddy, Byung, hung on. Byung, we love you, man. Yeah, but dude. a 10 in the second round on hole 17. He just put, couldn't put it on the green. Four? Was it four? Yeah, four balls in the water. Four balls in the water. Yeah. I mean, that's the that's the toughest part three I've ever seen. But Yeah. Come on, man. That's, it was... It got a little comical at a point. He was good about it on Twitter. He was yeah. chirping himself a little bit, but at that point, he's just depositing balls into the water. Um, and it was it was tough to see, but we saw tons of players make similar mistakes. So definitely not out of the ordinary, but beyond, it's all right. You'll bounce back. Now. Last thing I'll say about the players is that, of course, I take JT to win last week. He wins this week. It's just classic. Classic, yeah. classic me. Yeah, just didn't want to bet. Someone else at this table did, but we'll get that later. Uh, some great news, though. Tiger Woods is headed back home. Uh, he left the hospital in L.A. Uh, this morning. He's resting back at home, so that's huge news. Love to see that, get in the comfort of his own home, um, and just rest up and, and try and feel better. Yeah, prayers always to Tiger. We're thinking about you, buddy. Keep doing you. Yeah. Um, I believe that wraps up our little recap. So yeah. before we get into our preview of the Honda Classic, we just want to shout out our good friends over at WGRE again. So... Roll the tape. Tune in to 91.5 WGRE, your sound alternative. Now moving into the Honda Classic preview, another very exciting tournament, not as big of a field. Uh, some guys are rusting up this week, yeah. trying to get ready for the next big tournaments coming yeah, the up. the Masters in less than a month, yeah. so. They're, they're starting to dial it in. Yeah, uh, Honda Class this weekend, I mean, you can't complain. It's, I think it's going to be great golf, as we've seen the past, mm -hmm. I mean, since we started the show. Do you think there's yeah. any correlation there that the golf has been phenomenal all of a sudden when we start a show? I think guys are pretty self-conscious about what we said. Yeah, they are they're definitely listen, um, and I think we just sort of kicked off this incredible golf season. Yeah. Pat on the back to us, but whatever. Uh, yeah, limited field. It, it should be a nice tournament. It's at PJ National in Florida, so this is our fourth straight week uh, with the course in Florida. Um, last year's winner, Sung JM, it will be back there. He's playing again. Um, but yeah, I mean, excited to watch it, but yeah. it's going to be a little tough to catch in between March Madness, but still golf on TV, you can never complain. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't really have a whole lot to say about the Honda Classic, except for what you just said, that it's, it's more golf, and I'm excited yeah. to see it. Uh, I've got 
some very strong feelings about who's going to win this tournament, and we'll we'll get into that. Uh, you got anything else to say about Honda Classic? No, I think we've sent over to uh, the gambling green where we have a little special guest for you guys. Yeah. One, two, three. Welcome to the gambling green, presented by Brawl Associated and our very good friends over at Titleist. Yes. Genie, still waiting on you to respond to my emails. Yeah. Uh, as in terms of the sponsorship deal. Um, I don't know why you wouldn't want just, to pair with us. Just do it. Just shoot me one back. Like, just do it. Ping me, slack me, whatever. Like, let's just get it going. Benny. Whoa. You you grew quite a bit. You know, in Benny's contract, it says that he deserves medical leave if there's any head injuries. And because he's on concussion protocol right now, I'm going to be placing uh, in his spot today for the gambling green. I know that I'm yeah. not as good as Benny, but hey, we'll get through this. So we appreciate it, Captain America. I'm Josh. 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 Thank oh, you, Captain America. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Nice to see you. Yep. Yep. Good to see all right, so uh, how it works here, Josh, is we've got our picks, three picks. I hope you made some picks. We've got three of them, winners, top 20, wild card. Yep, I got them ready to go. All right, we're going to have you go second. I'm going to open this up today because Glenn's going to do his whole thing. Fine. Yeah, just let me just pop this for a second. Kind of have... uh, the hat's on again. So this is the fifth straight week. Um, I won another one. Shocking, I know. Uh, Jason Kokrak, top 20. Should have won another one with Fitzpatrick, top Englishman, but Lee West would just ball out for some reason. Uh, but yeah, another pick one. Uh, it's getting a little boring. I'd love some competition here, um, so that'd be much appreciated. But another one, just write it down. With a smaller field, there could be a lot of a lot of people. A lot of good picks. Picks. So Good So let's hope the Cowboy have moves, huh? Yes, that's so lead us off. Man. Okay, yeah. So I'm gonna start my picks. I got Taylor Gooch to win plus 2800. He had a really nice uh, weekend at the Players. Um, a little bit of a silly name, but I like him uh, to win. He's got great odds, especially with the limited field. He was playing up against some real, real players last week and improved his own. I got Richie Rowensky, top 20 at plus 270. He's also had a really nice little stretch the past five weeks. He's two top 20s. Um, and then Young, my guy, I'm taking you as the top Asian player, plus 550. I know you had a tough hole and missed the cut. After 17, getting a 10 on it. I think you're going to bounce back heavy, and I'm rooting for you. I'm going to shoot you a text right after this, but beyond, I like I like your odds this week. Buddy. You know, I like your picks. Taylor Gooch didn't get a lot of camera time last week, but played really, really well with the players. Right. Uh, another really guy, uh, guy that played well with the players was Adam Scott, closest to the green, or closest to the pin on number 17 to players every round. He, numbered, he was That's within impressive. four feet of the hole from every single shot they took off in number 17. And then for my top 20, I'm going to go Ricky Fowler. Uh, I think that you know he's always in the top 10, top 20, somewhere around there, but he just can never close it out. So I'd give him top 20, and I think that's pretty realistic. And uh, the wild card, he tied for 35th, I believe, last week. The players, Phil Mickelson, the lefty. Pretty good show. You know, he was minus one, I think, overall in the three rounds. Yeah. But I still think that he could, you know, really pull something out this weekend. I like that. All right. Sounds good. And for me, my final picks, like I said, I had a special set of picks this week, and it's going to be winner, Sung J M plus 1,400. He won this tournament last year, and I think he goes for the 2P. Guess what? Sung J M. Top 20 pick, oh. minus 110. And guess a triple down? To make the cut, Sung J M, the safest. You can't win if you don't make the cut. More of a lock than Carlos Rodriguez wow. going for five ground balls in a lacrosse game. Wow. Okay. To make the cut, Sung J M, minus 500. Wow. Those are my picks. Putting all the eggs in the basket. I'm all over Sung J M. I know. Get scrambled I know, uh, I'm sorry, his name again. Uh, Byung Hung Han. Yes, yes, I know he's our guy. Young. He's our I friend. Know, I know he's our guy, but I'm going to have to go with Sung J in this weekend, taking it. Uh, I like those picks. Uh, boys, really nice episode. Like, yeah. very well. Thank you. Gosh. I appreciate you having me on. Thank you. We'll miss you. We'll miss you very soon. Uh, fifth installment. Thank you guys for sticking with us. Love you guys. We'll see you soon. Cheers.